Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be modding the Eishin E011 and I'm going to be putting a B-Core uh, flight controller in here. Uh, this has the same plugs for the, the 7mm motors that are on the E011 and should work just fine. I did attempt to flash this board uh, with the Acro firmware and uh, for whatever reason uh, either my equipment didn't work right or I didn't do it correctly this board is uh, not functioning anymore so that whole project went out the window so I know that some of you guys still want to be able to fly this with a um, bigger transmitter and you can do this uh, this particular board here is the free sky version I think there's also a fly sky and spectrum versions of this board and uh, I'm gonna fly this with the that controller that came with the uh, DYS elf uh, I'm gonna be it's pretty easy mod. I just unscrewed the flight controllers on. I'm going to plug in the motor wires into uh, the bottom of the board here. Stick that, mount that on with the two screws. And then I'm going to uh, stick this little modded uh, video transmitter camera. I basically cut up uh, this video transmitter. This is from a, a QX90. And I got rid of the camera and I put on this other Pico camera here with some wires. And also got rid of the cloverleaf antenna and just put on this uh, little uh, whip antenna here. I'm just going to stick this on under the flight controller and have the camera in the front. Actually, this is the front over here. So have a, it'll be a low profile. So it's pretty easy to put together. I'll go ahead and put that together and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so I got the board mounted and it's going to be hard to see here what's going on. So I'm going to just put a photo up. Basically, I got the video transmitter in between the four motor plugs and it just fits in perfectly in this mod right between those four motor plugs and between the battery bay and the flight controller um, yeah it's really hard to see but you can see it fits in there really nice and then the antenna just sticks out the side here just past that little standoff out the back and all I gotta do now is hot glue the camera in here into this little space right here. And then stick the top back on. Uh, because of the USB port there, I did have to put a little bit of a cut out here in the plastic. I just used my cutters for that so that the top can sit, on, sit down on there flat. So I'll go on there flat. And that's pretty much it. If you guys want to see the mod where I uh, modded the video transmitter here, this is from the uh, QX90, I believe. I just got rid of the camera so I can use this other camera here and got this nice flat low profile. Got rid of the circular polarized antenna. If you want to see that video, I'll just put a card in the corner. You guys can see how that's done. It's pretty easy to do. So I'll just go ahead and I'll, I'll leave you a little bit of flight footage of this guy uh, flying around the park. And I'll talk to you guys in the next one.